Hello there, I'm out here in the Ocala National Forest doing a review on the Blake Pro Gear Carbon 100 trekking poles. So let's get to it. Okay, these Blake Pro Gear Carbon 100 trekking poles come with extra baskets. These here, there's it for snow. Not going to need them down here. These here, these you slip onto the bottom, no threading. These are for sand, loose gravel. Today I'm not using those. Today I'm using this piece. I find it's good. It keeps me from going into the loose sand too much. This end here will pop right off. Just slides off. You got a pointed end. It's good for ice, other things. Pop that back on. It's good for a little bit of traction. Now what we're really interested in here is these cam locks. Cam locks are awesome. Take the cam lock here. Just flip it with your finger. Slide your pole in and out very easily. Put it to the measurement. You can, you can kind of remember what it is after a while. If it's a little loose when you snap it, take this little knurly knob, twist it in a little bit, tighten the cam a little bit. As soon as you pull out, you feel some tension, snap it on. Good to go. Solid. Two of those compresses the pole quite nicely. Up here on the top, spring shock. Really nice when you're on harder terrain. Turn it, you'll hear a click. The other way, you'll hear a click. Cushiony. Not so cushiony. Still has a little bit of cushion either way. This one definitely much more. The Ava handles really nice because they extend below the grip. Very firm, non-slip. Your sweat's not going to interfere. You're not going to slide down. Very nice. Um, on the top, on each pole, you have a compass. And uh, that's kind of nice because you should never go trekking or hiking in the woods without a compass. And the handles here Cushioned on the inside, nice, comfortable, soft. They're not going to tear at your wrists. To adjust them, it's very, very simple and so much nicer than buckle systems, which tend to shred the back of your hand. You pull on this extra piece here, and you'll see that this little thing pops out at the middle here underneath. Pop that out. That's attached to uh, this here. And you pull this out. Now you can just pull the other part of the handle right there. Slide it, take this little cam type thing, snap it back in there, good to go. You want to do it again, just give it a good chug. That's it. These are nice poles, very comfortable, very lightweight, and I have had many different trekking poles in my day. The one thing I do not want to hang on to when I'm in the middle of nowhere and a thunderstorm is coming is a piece of metal. These are carbon fiber. I really don't like going out in the middle of nowhere whether it's the Cascade Mountains, the Ocala Forest, White Mountains, Adirondacks, you name it. You don't want to be out there in a thunderstorm hanging on to a big metal pole. This is carbon fiber. I feel better with this. It's flexible. It's sturdy. It's much stronger than steel. It's lightweight and it's compact. You can very easily collapse it. Take it like this. Snap, snap. Pull the thing together. Put the cam lock in, throw it in your pack. You can use one at a time or two at a time. Either way, these are really sweet bowls. I love them.